Baron Laurent Iatvos de Vassarosnemeni Hungarian, Vassarosnemeni Baro Iatvos Laurent Augustin or Laurent Iatvos, pronounced Laura N. D. Otvo, 27 July 1848 – 8 April 1919, more commonly called Baron Roland von Iatvos in English literature, was a Hungarian physicist. He is remembered today largely for his work on gravitation and surface tension, and the invention of the torsion pendulum. Iatvos Laurent University the Laurent Iatvos Mathematics Competition and the Iatvos Crater on the Moon are named after him. Life Born in 1848, the year of the Hungarian Revolution, Iatvos was the son of the Baron Joseph Iatvos de Vassarosnameni (1813–1871), a well-known poet, writer, and liberal politician who was cabinet minister at the time and played an important part in 19th-century Hungarian intellectual and political life. His mother was the Hungarian noble lady Agnes Rosti de Barcoch (1825–1913), member of the illustrious noble family Rosti de Barcoch that originally hailed from the Vas County, and through this he descended from the ancient medieval Hungarian noble Pernesi family, which died out in the 18th century. Lauren's uncle was Paul Rosti de Barcoch (1830–1874), was a Hungarian nobleman, photographer, explorer, who visited Texas, New Mexico, Mexico, Cuba, and Venezuela between 1857 and 1859. Lauren Iatvos first studied law, but soon switched to physics and went abroad to study in Heidelberg and Königsberg. After earning his doctorate, he became a university professor in Budapest and played a leading part in Hungarian science for almost half a century. He gained international recognition first by his innovative work on capillarity, then by his refined experimental methods and extensive field studies in gravity. Iatvos is remembered today for his experimental work on gravity, in particular his study of the equivalence of gravitational and inertial mass the so-called weak equivalence principle and his study of the gravitational gradient on the Earth's surface. The weak equivalence principle plays a prominent role in relativity theory and the Iatvos experiment was cited by Albert Einstein in his 1916 paper The Foundation of the General Theory of Relativity. Measurements of the gravitational gradient are important in applied geophysics, such as the location of petroleum deposits. The CGS unit for gravitational gradient is named the EOTVOS in his honor. From 1886 until his death, Laurent Iatvos researched and taught in the University of Budapest, which in 1950 was renamed after him Iatvos Laurent University. Iatvos is buried in the Karapezi Cemetery in Budapest, Hungary. Topic. Torsion balance A variation of the earlier invention, the torsion balance, the Iatvos pendulum, designed by Hungarian Baron Laurent Iatvos, is a sensitive instrument for measuring the density of underlying rock strata. The device measures not only the direction of force of gravity, but the change in the force of gravity's extent in the horizontal plane. It determines the distribution of masses in the Earth's crust. The Iatvos torsion balance, an important instrument of geodesy and geophysics throughout the whole world, studies the Earth's physical properties. It is used for mine exploration, and also in the search for minerals, such as oil, coal and ores. The Iatvos pendulum was never patented, but after the demonstration of its accuracy and numerous visits to Hungary from abroad, several instruments were exported worldwide, and the richest oilfields in the United States were discovered by using it. The Iatvos pendulum was used to prove the equivalence of the inertial mass and the gravitational mass accurately, as a response to the offer of a prize. This equivalence was used later by Albert Einstein in setting out the theory of general relativity. This is how Iatvos describes his balance. It was just a simple, straight stick that I used as instrument, specially loaded at both ends, enclosed into a metal sheath to protect it from the wind and temperature changes. Upon this stick every single mass, be it near or far, exerts a directing force, but the wire upon which it hangs resists, and whilst resisting it twists, with the degree of this twist showing us the exact magnitude of the forces acting upon the stick. This is a Coulomb balance, and that is all there is to it. It is simple, like the flute of Hamlet, you only have to know how to play on it, and just like the musician who can delight you with splendid variations, the physicist can, on this balance, with no less delight determine the finest variations of gravity. 
This way we can peer into such depth of the crust of the earth, that neither our eyes, nor our longest drills could reach. One of Iatvo's assistants who later became a noted scientist was Rado von Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Honours To honour Iatvos a postage stamp was issued by Hungary on 1 July 1932. Another postage stamp was issued on 27 July 1948 to commemorate the centenary of the birth of the physicist. Hungary issued a postage stamp on 31 January 1991. See also EOTVOS, a unit of gravitational gradient Iotvos effect, a concept in geodesy Iotvos number, a concept in fluid dynamics Iotvos rule for predicting surface tension dependent on temperature List of geophysicists Lorandite, a mineral named after Laurent Iotvos References Topic. Further reading Antal, J. The Pest School of Medicine and the Health Policy of the Centralists. On the Centenary of the Death of Joseph Iotvos. Orvosi Hedelop, published May 9, 1971, 112 19, pp. 1083-9, PMID 4932574, Topic. External links Iotvos and Step, Biographical Remarks and a Summary of his Research Iotvos Laurent Virtual Museum